OK, we're all Strava junkies. We all enjoy riding the segments, but how on earth do we actually create one? Now I may well be very sad and anoraki thinking that having my own Strava segment is something very special. Here then is how you can create one for yourself and spread the Strava love. So to create your Strava segment you will need a Strava account, uh, but it doesn't matter if you have the paid one or the free one, it works just as well on both. Now the next thing you need to do is find a piece of road that you wish to define as a segment. Uh, and you can do this in many ways, but what I'm going to do is find one of my old rides and create a segment on a piece of road that I, I rode along recently. So here we are in my activity feed, uh, and I'm just going to scroll down. And I recently went to Mallorca, so I'll create a segment on one of the rides that I did over there. So I click on the ride, and that brings up the data, and more importantly the map. So let's come up to this little spanner icon here on the left hand side and click there and come up to the top where it says create segment. So I click there and here we are. This is, this is basically the ride that I did that day and at the very top here we've got a slider with a green dot and a red dot. Now the green dot defines the start position and at the moment here we are near Port Alcudia uh, and the piece of uh, road that I wish to define as a segment is this little link road here. So let's just move the start point close to that little link road. Oop, that's too far. So let's come back a bit. Oop. There we go there. So leave that. And now let's find the end point. At the moment it's up here in the mountains. Let's bring it back. And as I'm doing this, you can see that the profile of the segment is also changing down the bottom here, this blue uh, profile. So there we go, we went a bit wrong there. And there we are at the end of the road. So let's use the arrows to zoom in. We can drag the map. Let's go in a bit more. Uh, the end point isn't quite right, so let's just come back a little bit. There we go, that's the very end of that link road. So let's zoom out. So that's the piece of road defined. And here is the, uh, the, the profile and distance information. So you can see the, the segment started at kilometre 7 and it ended at kilometre 13. So that's pretty much exactly five kilometres. The end elevation is 36 metres and the start elevation is sea level. So it's a climb of 36 metres over five kilometres. So having defined that and we're happy with that, let's come up to next. And what it's going to do is search for duplicates. And, and I mean, Mallorca is a very popular place to go and there are plenty of segments very similar to that, but I'm going to say create my segment. And let's click next. And now let's give it a name. So let's just call it um, Leonard's Link Road. And when I've made segments before, the mistake I've made is not unchecking this box where it makes the segment private. So let's uncheck that and now click create. So that basically is how you create a segment. Once you've done it, it will take a little while to populate the leaderboard, but um, from now on, every time anybody rides over that segment, they will be timed and their, their names and times entered into the leaderboard. So yeah, it's all pretty cool, and you have your very own Strava segment. So there we go. That's how you create a Strava segment. Thanks for watching.